Welcome. In this video, we will explain basic input and output functions. Note, we are connecting 10 mock tests on student calendar co-dotting website from 25th December 2018 to 4th January 2019. And if you take 10 mock tests, definitely 50 to 65 percent of the model questions are coming in the main examination. Take this opportunity and we are initiated for your success in the basic input output functions basic input output functions in c language are printf and scanf we are not at all discussing other things only focusing on printf and scanf printf and scanf functions are inbuilt library functions in c programming language which are available in c library by default these functions are declared and the related macros are defined in standard input output header file stdio.h which is a header file in C language. So regarding scanf, it is an input function. In C programming language, scanf function is used to read character string numerical data from keyboard. Consider below example program where user enters a character. This value is assigned to the variable ch and then displayed then the user enters a string and this value is assigned to the variable str and then displayed so the syntax of scanf scanf format specifiers ampersand value 1 ampersand value 2 so on similarly the second syntax is int scan const character star format comma variable 1 variable 2 so on here Small example, scan of percentage %d, percentage %f. Percentage %d and percentage %f are format specifiers for the particular variables. So the format specifiers, format specifier description and supported data types, percentage %c for character, character and unsigned character, percentage %d for signed integer, short, unsigned, short, int and log, percentage small e or percentage capital E, scientific notations of float values float and double percentage f floating point float percentage g or capital g similar to percentage e or percentage capital e scientific notation of float values percentage hi signed integer percentage hu unsigned integer percentage i signed integer percentage l or percentage ld or percentage li signed integer percentage lf floating point percentage capital lf floating point percentage lu unsigned integer percentage lli a percentage lld signed integer percentage llu unsigned integer percentage o octal representation of integer percentage p address of point to wide percentage s for string percentage u for unsigned integer percentage small x or percentage capital x hexadecimal representation of unsigned integer percentage n for printing nothing percentage percentage prints percentage character using these format specifiers in scan of function and print of function to print the values of the variables some extra uses of scan of in a fast assignment we were required to read strings one at a time without the slash n so that we could print them all one all on one line square brackets in scan of allow us to define which characters to read from input scan of percentage in the square bracket student yes string in this example the program uses scan of to ask user for a string student determines the characters the program will only take the characters s t u d e and n so if the input were d and t variable d could become d and t whereas if the input were d a t variable d could would print become d t in the second example scan of percentage within the square brackets cap symbol slash n says string this example determines part of the affirmated assignment here we have within the square brackets cap slash n the not operator is used not the character slash n causes scan of to read everything but the character slash n which is automatically added when you press return after entering input 
Scanf also allows us to format our input in various ways. We can ignore preceding white spaces or determine the number of integers we would like to read from the user's input. Scanf percentage is string. In this example, white space preceding slash percentage is means that any leading white spaces before the string will be ignored. So if the input was student, our variable string would like to print to take print student. Scan of percentage D 2D input. In this example, we have a number located between the percentage and D, which, is, which in this case is 2. The number determines the number of integers our variable input of integer type will read. So, if the input was 3222, our variable would only read 32. <coughs> so, decimal integer using scanf function, we are giving 45 as an input and a 45 will be printed. Here, scanf percentage ampersand a, print of percentage slash a, so 45 will be printed. <coughs> Excuse me. In the second example, percentage a address of a, input is 017 it is octal decimal octal equivalent to 15 similarly 0 xf f octal decimal equivalent to 15 so 15 will be printed so, um, floating data point percentage f percentage e percentage lf so here we are taking an example of percentage f percentage f takes six decimal points so here we take six decimal points percentage is string we print the string value and uh, stdio.h <coughs> single character we need to read the single character and we need to print the single character in the program coming to the printf in c programming language printf function is used to print the character string float integer octal and hexadecimal values onto the output screen we use printf function with percentage the format specifier to display the value of an integer variable similarly percentage c is used to display character percentage f for floating variable percentage s for string variable percentage lf for double and percentage x for hexadecimal value to generate a new line we use slash n in c printf statement printf format specifier escape sequence characters variable 1 variable 2 so on int a is equal to int a is equal to 10 w is d is equal to 13.4 print of percentage f percentage d d comma a it prints the value of d and a in a respective manner <coughs> escape sequences are slash a for alarm or beep slash b for backspace slash f for form feed slash n for new line slash r for curry is written slash t for tab horizontal space slash b for vertical tab slash slash for black slash slash question mark for single quotation slash slash double quotes for double quotes slash slash question mark for question mark slash nnn octal number slash xhh hexadecimal number slash o for null so here are the character format specifier percentage c we need to read a character and we need to print the character and uh, integer format for uh, percentage d and percentage i percentage e also prints same value percentage also prints same value uh, float and e uh, here this is the scientific notation uh, 12.674 zeros here second one e is used U e or g are used 1.2673 zeros e plus 0 01 and unsigned octal number for given integer so take an integer 67 and we need to print octal number it is 10 3, 1 or 3 hexadecimal also 15 is uh, 15 equivalent to f <coughs> percentage f printing formats print f percentage star dot star f with precision number or percentage with dot precision f comma number for printing 65.50 print f percentage star dot star f comma 5 comma 2 comma number or 5.2 f or dot 2 and a point 2 f we can represent any one of the way three ways you can represent any one of the way 
and string representation uh, percentages <coughs> here more formatting 20s minus 20s 20.7 s minus 20.7 so this 20 indicates it prints 20 characters it prints 20 characters and 20.7 means leave 7 spaces after 20 characters we need to print here also same way and uh, some coding examples of escape characters as include this these are the characters it indicates a mobile number <coughs> escape characters slash b slash b slash b the output will be same there is no change <coughs> so when using escape character of slash n it comes into the new line and when I am using tab space, it gives tab space. When I am using vertical space, V space, there is no change. But when I am using R, only prints after slash R. Before slash R will be ignored. Some extra uses of printf. Character. <coughs> Example 1. Care letter A, int number 9. We need to print letter and number. In this example, we demonstrate how to print multiple variables. Here, percentage C corresponds to the, our character variable called letter and percentage D corresponds to our integer variable called number. We have included slash n in new line character, which will print a new line to separate our two variables. So, 9a and 9 will be printed in the next lines. In the second example, uh, x is equal to 10. Uh, percentage 5D after 5 spaces 10 will be printed. Thank you.